So when it comes to the members, um, they, the members in California, especially in the Long Beach area, there's quite a few members. Like I said, there's about eight or nine stakes within Long Beach. And some of the members that I had the pleasure of coming in contact with, it was kind of neat too, because like I said, I, I was served in a singles ward and a family ward. And so I've always, I was able to have kind of a lot more contact with different members in different stages of their life, you could say. And I just, I was always so shocked by how strong the members are out there. Like certainly there's, there's people that kind of struggle with testimonies anywhere, but um, the members, once they were inspired by correct and true principles that you bore testimony of to them as far as inspiring them to want to do missionary work. Uh, they were so quick to act all the time that once you gave them that inspiration, um, well not, I, I, I shouldn't say that we gave them, that once they felt the prickling of their, of their hearts from our testimonies, from the spirit we'll try to bring, um, they would always be so happy to help the missionaries out. So never hesitate to bear testimony frequently of what you know to be true, of your love for the Savior and the Savior's love for them. And especially by showing them your love for the Savior through obedience. Because once they see that, they will, they're so quick to help the missionaries out. I felt always their love and support all the time. And that was an extreme safe haven always for missionaries, I think. Um, but for me personally, I'm, I'm always very honored from the friendships that I, I've gained and from the examples of, of the members that I, I've seen and that they're always so happy to have missionaries around and they really look to you as a source of light and never never take that for granted never please don't take that for granted because just know that there are missionaries before you that um, that worked really hard in those areas i worked really hard to labor um, for the lord and to serve the members and so please keep that love going because those those members deserve it and especially more than anything the Lord deserves it because you are establishing the Lord in every area that you go to and working with members is a big part of that and they certainly do take care of the missionaries you always will have dinner appointments by the way and um they, they love their missionaries, and so missionaries, please, please love those members back too, and serve them in the way Heavenly Father would want you to.